good shot there from Tate. Girls love money, and that's not entirely true. So basically, everyone remembers when Luke didn't know what yoga fire and yoga flame was. I said I was going to buy Street Fighter. I couldn't find the SNES thing. So I had to buy an arcade machine. So Luke, in his fear, decided to hurt his hands on purpose and have double hand surgery. He no. formulated a plan to put him out back. <laughs> to avoid getting buffed up at Street Fighter. So I buy an arcade machine to teach him about Yoga Fire. And now he can't do it. I cannot fight. Luke uh, has no hands. It's not out of fear. Who's out of fear? He's definitely out of fear. Here comes a new challenger. Dal Sim. Dal Yoga fire, yoga flame. Luke doesn't know. Luke doesn't know. Luke doesn't know. I'm Dal Sin. That's Dal Sin. Shit. I'm Ryu, or Ryu. You are nobody, because you've got no hands. Jacuzzi, the heating ain't on for the jacuzzi. There's some kind of windstorm, some Arctic windstorm. It's an emergency. We're in an emergency <laughs> situation. We have no cameras in our war room. Why don't we buy a backup generator? That's a good idea. Look, that's a good idea. All I know is, who's the idiot now? Now we're not starving to death. We've got the cans, we've got the wine, we've got the whiskey. He has a very good point. Thank you, Ron Paul. Whiskey is not, we need, we need oh, power. Sorry. We need a diesel generator. Listen, we need whiskey. That's all we need. Whiskey and if you has... observe the booze collection over here, this is just a fraction of the collection of fine boozes which I have stashed in case of an emergency just like this. Boozes. So I'm going to crack open this beautiful bottle of Johnny Walker Blue Label, get a few glasses, and we're going to sit down at the table and have a wonderful fucking time. I'm immersed in the table booze. We have ice cream. We need ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. We have ice cream. Ice cream's gonna melt. I'm gonna go get some ice cream. Who's a baby? Bring ice. Alright, let's drink whiskey and smoke cigars in the power cup. Obviously. Obviously. Me and Andrew, we're not scared of having no electricity. We once ran up an electricity bill so high in our flat in Dunstable that we couldn't pay that we called the electricity company and lied and said, oh, we just moved in. We don't know. Uh, yeah, this Tristan Tate is just a... Uh, I don't know who he was. My name is, is Andrew Tate. And Andrew tried to pretend he just moved in. So then they said they needed to speak to the landlord. So we got our friend Glenn, our friend, to call and say that he was our landlord when he wasn't to the electricity company. And eventually they believed him. And then they put us on an electricity meter. So our electricity would go down 20 pounds at a time. It would tip down until we get into a situation like this. So I ain't scared of a situation like this. Yeah, we lived this way. Oh, a few candles. We lived without electricity until the fucking money came in. But we didn't even have emergency food or booze. 
Did not you see booze? Yeah. Crystal decanter for Johnny Wolf Blue Lake. the answer? Is booze the answer to anything? Do you have ice? It's cookie dough. Cookie, cookie dough, dough ice. <laughs> <laughs> you have no hand. Luke has no hand. I love the smoke. I love the smoke. I need ice for my whiskey. Command the wench to bring ice. Wench! Ice from the freezer. Single word, simple command. <laughs> Here we go. Now we go from the keepers, may as well smoke them. Three Cubans. Me and my boys, we're on follow. Luke, Andrew. I'm gonna smoke a big Davidoff. No Davidoff, no suck me off. <laughs> we might be doing good, let's see. Let me tell you a story about dystopian future. At some point in the next 10 years, you, me, and Tristan are going to be in some kind of car crash in the Mongolian mountains, and we're all going to have injuries. And Tristan and I are going to continue to walk all the way, bus up, no fucking plasters, no cast, we're going to get to the end. And your baby ass is going to be like, oh, but I haven't got cast, I don't have plasters. No, but I wouldn't, I'd walk. You'd die. I would walk. Well, then take off your fucking thing and be walk in the Mongolian desert, bro. You're either a hero or you're not a hero. When I bust my hand, you put the picture in, I bust my hand, I punched him in the top of his head, I broke my hand, I continued to punch for 12 rounds, I broke my hands in eight places. I went in for fucking emergency surgery, I put it on, and as soon as they said you can't drive with a cast in validation insurance, I got a fucking Stanley knife, cut it off, and put on a glove, bro. Like fact, a G. A witness to that story is flying in. He'll be here in two hours. I've replaced you, Luke. I'm getting a replacement, Luke. One, because you're out of action, because you cut your pinkies. And two, because you look like a fucking geek with those gloves on your hands. I can't hang around with you. You have to replace Luke until he removes the cat. Take him off immediately. Be you a look, man. You look like a baby. Oh, I can my pinky. For everyone watching at home, he's cut his pinkies. That's why he's wearing see those masks. tendons pinkies. are zoom, zoom in on these things. Three tendons. Zoom in. And two nerves. Pinky face on that. Pinky. With that amount of bandaging, it, you should have no pinkies at all. Yeah. If they're still there. Then you don't need that much. Yeah, that's amputation level bandaging. It's right? Romania. They don't know how to minimize the amount of bandages they use. I blame the Romanians for the amount of bandages. Take off. It's Romania. The calves. You look like a geek. You're bringing shame on this family. You're bringing shame on this family. I've let you into my household and into this family, and you're bringing shame on them. All right, so if I take them off, I'm going to recast them. But in a more effective manner. There is no casting. There's no casting, bro. There is. Take them off. There is. Fine. Don't, don't take them off. Please don't take them off. <laughs> Luke, take off the casts. No, no, Andrew no. took out the stitches in my head one day after I got them because they looked stupid and I needed to gel my hair. So Andrew will take off your casts. He's a professional. I don't need my I'm hair. a doctor. I've got a PhD. Yeah. In fact, no, no, let, let's enter it. Let, let, right now, let's post the photo in the series of you taking the stitches out of my head because that photo does exist. I had him for one day, couldn't gel my hair, my hair looked whack. I've got a PhD. Your hands look worse than my hair. Take them off. I've got a Pippin Hose to read, bro. But I'm not going anywhere. Take off the cast. We're staying in home. So? And there's no one to impress. There are people to disappoint you. Your lovely cousins who have let you come here and be a millionaire are upset with the way you're conducting yourself. <laughs> because I have casts on. Yes. You look like a geek. Do I take them off? No. And if you look like a geek, you must be a it's geek. True. And true. you're hanging around me looking like a geek. Embarrassing me in front of Rumfold. They are very impractical, however. Yeah, it looks like a geek. Shit. However. Shit, they are very impractical. <laughs> very impractical, however. Take off the cast. I'll go, I'll go get Andrew a knife and he's taking them off. For long term. No, 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 don't need to get a knife. What do you mean, no? For long term. Yeah, keep on, reasons. Keep on. But. I could walk through the Mount Mongolian desert without. No, no, no. I could. Now, if a doctor told you to sit still and don't walk, keep waiting. Or die. Life. No, I'm gonna walk. Well, you're time. dying now of embarrassment, and you're killing me along with you. Is that a thing? Mm-hmm. It's true that it is too much. You look like a geek. You cut your pinky. I cut my pinky when I was a kid. What day is it? I've cut my tendons. Your tendons are now stitched together with surgical thread. They're stronger than ever. You got Matt. You got invincible bionic hands. I don't believe they're stronger than ever. I believe they are. I believe they used to be very strong. Now they've gotten weak. Remember yesterday when I said we can't be cousins with such a cunt? I was going to.
replace Luke. Luke, come in. Luke. Yeah. Here we go. Not Luke. What do you mean? I'm here. I've known him for ages and his name's Rory. No, I'm Luke. This is our cousin Luke. I've officially replaced Luke. Then he is. He's our cousin. We've known him since we were kids. So this is Luke now. This is Luke. Oh. I I I look at his hands. What do you think this is? A fucking game. These are the hands of a cousin of ours. It's hate hands. They're not crab hands. Yeah. At least you could punch somebody. Here's Luke. I'm Luke. Oh, Luke. Welcome home. How's your mom? How's Aunt Kathy? Is she good? She's good. She's lost with you, actually. Yeah. Your sister's Sophie? She's good. Sophie's alright. She's doing well. She's doing well. She's doing well. It's awesome to hear. I'm, I'm glad that. I'm glad. Alright, thanks so much, bro. You know who your room is, yeah? Cool, man. Bye, G. G Galloway. God damn it, G. Have some bullshit crab hands. How are you gonna fight with them? I'm not rolling with a guy who can't fight. He if can I'm punch. Luke, you can. Why is he with my jacket on? He's Luke. Because I'm Luke, and this jacket fits me because I'm Luke. He's Luke now. You, I don't know what you are. No cousin of mine walks around like this, bro. He's Luke. What do you mean? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> so, are we staying in a hotel? No, we're going home. If Luke wants to have a drink, I'm drinking. I don't want a drink. The fuck are you? Luke, we drink it. Yeah, hell no. No, it's Luke, look. This is just a random Luke, man. Don't, I'm not around the man. I'm fine. Tell this guy. Oh, you're meant to be family. You're meant to be my cousin. Don't disrespect our family, bro. I don't know who you are. He's got a cousin, Luke. Luke, can you grab the matches and can't do a whiskey? What? Thanks, thanks, bro. Thanks, cousin. He may look like he's fine, but he's actually pretending to be a cousin. Yeah. You look super white. He's got a picture of being Sophie. You've never seen such a tape. Exactly. Well, that's cognac, but that's all good. Cognac's good, good for me. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, yeah, you got glass for this guy. What's your name again, mate? Luke. Don't copy Luke's look, name. Look, look, Rory, just take a glass. Is his name Rory? Stupid fucking name. Fucking stupid name. Parents must be drunk, or I don't know the name exactly. Your mother is an esteemed university professor. So, I'm like, next flight. Like, I'll be on the next flight back to the States if this carries on. I'm not going to see another man in my fucking bed. <laughs> Chinese, guys! What, what you, this is my food. Bro, why are you eating my food? Look. Luke Freeman. It has my fucking name. Who's this random man? Fuck. And oh. why is he coming to eat my food now? You eat my cousin's food? Try to take my cousin's food. Seriously. Seriously. What are you doing? Fuck out of here. That's something for you. Please. You can have it. Please. Who is this man? man? I'll have to spark this stranger, but I'm going. Who is this man? (laughs) Rumpel. Bro, you're not going to stop this. Rumpel, you know me. Man, that Luke, innit? Obviously. Thank you. (laughs) Help yourself, guys. It's on me. Uh, I paid for it. No. I put my name on the receipt. See ya, that's funny. I see ya. Luke Freeman, not random cut in my house <laughs> on the receipt. Thanks. Oh, Luke. Hey, Luke. 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 <laughs> this is Luke's Chinese. Yeah. What are you invite? This is Luke's Chinese, bro. <laughs> His name's on the fucking receipt. <laughs> Bam! Can you read? Am I going insane? Yeah, thanks, Luke. Thanks, bro. No worries, man. Thanks, Luke. Man. This is bullshit. I try hard. Mm. I'm a good cousin.